Hey everybody, Steve here. I hope you are all doing well. Today I want to share with you a really cool new feature when you upgrade your iPhone to the newest operating system, 10.0.2. I'm going to show you how to use your iPhone as a magnifying glass. It's super easy and I think it's very, very helpful. So first thing you want to do Let's go into settings. So I tap my settings. You want to scroll down and go to general. Tap general. Now you want to scroll down just a little bit. Tap accessibility. Now if you look the third one down it says magnifier. You can just tap that and you can see you have an option of turning it on or off. Make sure you slide that to the right and you turn it on. So then let's go back out of there and I'm going to show you how to use the magnifier. It's really simple to activate the magnifier. You simply press the home button three times really fast. Bop, bop, bop. Okay, so I'm going to do that now. And now you're going to see it has activated the magnification window and it's pretty straightforward here. I've just put a 45 caliber bullet on my desk. So you have a slider. You can move the slider to the right and just continue to magnify. I'm going all the way over. You can actually see my reflection. That is pretty amazing magnification. All right. They also have a little lightning bolt. So if you tap the lightning bolt, you can throw your light on a subject. They have a lock button right there. I honestly don't really know what that is for. It doesn't really lock anything, so I'm a little bit confused about that. So I'm going to tap it again. Over here at the right, you can actually tap that button, and you can change the exposure somewhat. You can make it darker, lighter. You can play around with that if you need to. Tap the exposure again, and you go back to normal. So the only problem that I see with this that Apple needs to do is you don't have the ability to save that as a photo to your camera roll. But what you can do is if you push your power button and your home button at the same time, you can literally take a screenshot and the screenshot will be saved to your camera roll. So. That's the only thing, the only real flaw that I see with this thing. I wish, I hope maybe in a new update, Apple will change that and allow us to change, to save these images directly to the camera roll. So that's it. Hey, I hope you enjoy using your new magnifier. It's really pretty cool. I love this feature. So I'm Steve, and I'll see all of you in the next video.